Um, my group is the Translational Neuroimaging Group. Um, uh, almost all of the work we do involves using the imaging facilities uh, that are now all uh, encompassed in the Wellcome Centre for Integrative Neuro Neuroimaging uh, and OBA. Um, but actually, progressively, more of the team are involved in sort of devices and, um, uh, and other ways of phenotyping people. But broadly, what we try to do is understand uh, normal ageing. So how do we characterise normal ageing? How, uh, how can we find and characterise aspects of risk associated with cognitive or motor decline? in later life? Can we find mechanisms of resilience? Uh, can we develop biomarkers to, for experimental medicine in the space of uh, cognitive decline in later life? And how can we use the information that we collect to improve diagnosis and prognosis in the clinic? So the work that we do is, uh, is, is, is um, largely funded by the, uh, our new BRC, but also, as I've already said, part of the WIN, uh, and we're also part of the Oxford Parkinson's Disease Centre and other things that I now can't see. Um, so the thing that we are sort of most occupied with at the moment within my group is, is developing this thing we're calling the Brain Health Centre. So this is integrating uh, uh, um, research-grade assessment into clinical service in the memory clinic service. Um, so we are bringing people into, um, uh, we're diverting people away from the CT scan that they would otherwise have had and bringing them to OBA so that they can have high quality imaging alongside good quality cognitive assessments, etc. I'm in the really fortunate position of being able to talk about this for one minute when Clara Donoghue is going to talk about it in great detail later. But the, but the thing that I just wanted to highlight is that all of the words that I wrote on this slide were about developing this service for the memory clinic uh, and uh, older adults. But in fact, if you think about the true colour system, that John already described this morning that we're, that we're now um, also kind of uh, rebooting. Uh, all of these words apply there as well. So this model of creating integrated clinical assessment and research is one that we actually have some uh, great um, history in as well.